Hello and welcome back to the cove with more dying light. So we've made it back to the tower and we have a couple of missions to hand off. So let's go ahead and find those. So I think the first one was crayons for the children. Uh, that is nice and simple. So let's go ahead and find Kate. Uh, she says, oh, hang on, have you upstairs. Let's go ahead and jump in the elevator and see about handing them in. Found them from the school a while ago. We just haven't been back to the tower for quite some time. So, yeah, I guess this is our first opportunity to uh, get some extra XP. So, well, let's see. Whereabouts is she? I think she should be yeah, up a level according to the minimap. Let's go ahead and climb the stairs. We'll uh, scoot our way around there as fast as we can. And... Uh, whereabouts? Here she is. Hi there. You found some crayons. Oh, fantastic. You're the best. The kids are going to lose their minds. But in a good way. Here, take this. You'll make better use of it than I will. Uh, what did she give us? Oh, some cash. You know what? Those are some expensive artistic uh, crayons there for 1200 That is uh, very expensive. All right, well, apparently, uh, so we finished a one of those agility runs, those, uh, you yeah, talk to Vulcan? Huh. Um. Okay, so I guess we could go ahead and uh, catch up with him again. Um. Where is that? Oh, hang on a second, does it say? Talk to him. Oh, he's one of the guys at the tower. Actually, I think he's on the roof potentially um i don't know if that's necessarily where we should be going i suppose we can double check to see if he's here you know just uh, kind of kill two birds with one stone um let's see is anyone up here on the roof can we see anybody not really all right then well then i guess we're just going to head back on inside there's the door. And, uh, yeah, I guess we'll move on to the next location. So I'm guessing that's probably going to be up over towards the bay area. Uh, that's, I think we have some binoculars to hand on in. And then, uh, what else was there? I feel like there was something else. But again, we'll, uh, we'll figure that out when we can check our minimap properly. Uh, that'll do rather well. And then, uh, yeah, we also have another couple of uh, nighttime missions that we're going to need to do. One of them is for searching a cave in the darkness. And then the other one is trying to get some extra UV bulbs from the bridge, which is going to be all the just a little bit dangerous. But either way, uh, we also have picked up a couple of requisition packs, so let's oh, drop man. them off. This means we can survive for the next couple of days at least. There we go. Thank you so much. Uh, that'll help us out. And then, ooh, come I don't know if hmm, that could be interesting. Um, now we'll take the batteries and basics. I don't think we need the weapon. Yeah, we don't have a free space for it anyway, so we'll leave that be. And then, oh, you know what? We should check in on those who uh, sell some goods. So let's check Come here. the shot. A special deal. All right. So, uh, cricket bats, pickaxes. Nothing that amazing. No, I think that'll be fine. And we have nothing to sell. We've sold a fair bit of other stuff, so oh, yeah. that'll be fine. We could try a uh, fighting uh, challenge, but I think we're going to leave that for now. We'll come back at a different point. Again, most of the story does occur around here. Oh, hang on a second. Okay, so let's check our map. We have... Jealous Runner. Maybe we've picked up a second... A uh, second challenge to deal with him. Yeah, so that's also where we've got the uh, night time to do the uh, caves. And then what else have we got? Okay, was back to Santiago. Some DLC. I think what we'll do is... Let's go ahead and uh, check out the Jealous Runner, or maybe the dark area and scout that out before tonight happens and then we can uh scoot back as quickly as possible 
so we can get the uh, thing from the witch. But either way, let's go ahead and talk to Vulcan. Uh, that seems like one of the easier things to do and uh, will be a fairly good use of our time. So we'll deal with that. Oh, you know what? That's a that one. Instant escape, please and thank you. Yeah, we'll jump up over here, make our way around. Bounce our way around all of this. Oh. Well, that was a prime opportunity. An easy kill. Now, uh, what about this? Oh. Probably should have held down the space bar. I forgot to uh, hold down the uh, free line button. That was certainly a uh, bit of a mistake. And then... Alright, we'll deal with the viral chasing. There we go, that'll be fine. Let's go ahead and chat to the free runner. Where is he? Vulcan, there you are. Still among the living crane? So pull your socks up and try to beat my record this time. Hmm, I guess he's, uh... Yeah, pick up the map with the marked location. Oh, that's down here. You know what? Let's see how difficult up, this is. Let's go, asshole. Uh, medium as well. Four checkpoints within the given time. You know what the day is, but young, sure. Let's go ahead and uh, try it out. It's somewhere ahead of us, so let's just get moving. Yes, so far uh, not too complicated there. Um, I guess we'll run over here. Oh. Let's avoid getting hit if we can. That's two, and then... Where is the third? I guess we can cut through here. That'll be fine. And then where's the final one? Oh, just over there. You know what? I think we're uh, fairly well sorted. Yeah. This isn't going to be too hard at all. I'm glad we decided to pick up this challenge when we did. Victory. Excellent. I think he may you be a bit upset. By the skin of your teeth, if you ask me. You better get ready for next time, Crane. Hmm. All right, so we'll talk to him next time he has something for us. Uh, but at the very least, we have, uh, you know, picked up a few more agility points here and there. Uh, let's also chat to this guy, too, since we... I think we ignored him last time. Yeah, nothing that we really care about. So that'll be fine. Now, let's go... Yeah, we're going to go ahead and check out the cave for nighttime. It's getting closer. But again, I... Uh, yeah, I'd rather have an idea of what we're doing before things go south. Much easier. Make it a little bit easier to uh, escape from that situation if we know what we're dealing with. Also, too, I see we don't have much in the way of ammunition. Let's make a couple more arrows. Uh, that is going to be important. Uh, let's make... Oh, you know what? That's probably enough. That's a good 24 arrows that we've just crafted. I uh, see a viral coming our way. Probably go ahead and just, uh... Deal with him then. Yeah, no, let's just ignore them. Can't be bothered. Not my circus. Not my monkeys. Alright, uh, let's... Yeah, let's use the tunnel. I don't think we've ever used the tunnel much before. We do have that safe house nearby too, just in case we need it. Oh, looks like Vulcan's already got another offer for us. Um, you know what? Let's go to a melee weapon. That may be more important right now. And then, yeah, let's swim through here. It says we're entering a dark area. I'm guessing this is a, uh, yeah, another runner who didn't want to, uh, <laughs> oh, you know what, 
we just died. Ow. What the heck, man? I guess that's why we had to do it during nighttime. Man, that sucks. 2,000 uh, survivor points is kind of painful. Yeah, both the dark area. Who would have imagined? Um, I guess we might as well go ahead and uh, check out that airdrop. Uh, since that is in the neighborhood. We'll turn off our flashlight. Let's go. Let's go and uh, see if we can clear that of our Rises men. And then maybe we check back in on Vulcan and do another one. Yeah, let's go with the... Uh, Go with a bow and arrow. That'll be fine. Any sign of Rice's men? Yes. But not for long. Oh. Yep, come on. Now what? Stuff this. Oop. Got a little bit of an electrical hop there. Search these guys. Wait, take another. There's the other one. Alright. Last packages, medical supplies, all well and good. Alright, well then I guess we may as well go ahead and check in on Vulcan yet again. He's gonna get fairly sick of giving us, uh, of giving us these, uh, what do we call them? Challenges if we just keep on making them, uh, fairly easily. Alright, where are you now, buddy? Hey there. So, Crane, you still think of yourself as the best runner in the tower? Well... Show me then, but you're gonna have to be faster than before. Okay, so what are you offering this time round? You're in some serious denial if you think you can beat me. Okay, so this one is hard. Reach three checkpoints. Um, hmm. Let's give it a go. If we don't get it easily or uh, we see that it's a particularly challenging one, we'll come back for the one where we have just a little bit of extra... Uh, stamina once we go up a level but again for now we're just going to stay as is uh that is yeah this is where we need to go all right at least we've got a rough idea is the direction we need to be headed in uh let's go oh you know what this isn't actually looking as difficult as i thought it was And then, yeah, we just got to make it to the end there in 26 seconds. That's, uh, oh, not the best option there, hitting those things. But we could survive a lot worse. Yeah, okay, you know, I think this is completely feasible. The fact that we now know where we're headed, and it's really straightforward. In fact, oh, you know what? It makes no difference. That is still a victory. Well, I guess you he's going to be upset. By the skin of your teeth, if you ask me. You better get ready for next time, Crane. All right, buddy. All right, next time uh, we'll have another thing. Uh, but you know what? If we check out our skills, what is it? Yeah, agility level, we're actively 10. And we gain... Yeah, these ones are sort of our art here. So we gain... What is it? Uh, hmm. The basic movement? No. Uh, oh, here we are. Free running adept. So we get better at free running, run longer, climb more quickly, gain agility faster, and access to a new set of running abilities. And then we have the final one at level 12, which means we've become an expert free runner. Yep. Uh, running for longer, climbing more quickly, and of course more agility faster with the ultimate running abilities. So yeah, if we do get caught out too hard uh, on some of these challenges, We've always got that to look forward to, which we are slowly making progress towards. Uh, but in the meantime, let's figure out where we want to travel. Uh, it's already 7 p.m. Oh, sorry, 5 p.m. Uh, we do still need to get a 
bolter at some point, I think. Uh, let's see. We have the mushrooms. We have electronic parts. Binoculars we need to hand off. The hangar. And then, yeah, we bridge and look for a brother in the market. Otherwise, what else do we have? Yeah, so we have to sneak close to a bolter during the night and get a tissue sample. That's our current big thing to do. That'll give us a whole stack of survivor points. I think... Let's see, you know what? We're in a pretty good position right about here. Let's go over to our next safe zone. And maybe we sleep until night. And then we'll go ahead and uh, give it a shot. Yeah, I think that should be all right. Yeah. So uh, let's go ahead and uh, make our way out of here. Uh, we do have some... We do have some packages to deliver from our uh, quartermaster or whatever. Now we'll avoid you for now. Yeah, here we are. This is the safe zone. Which, uh... How do we... Get in. Oh, here we are. There we are. Okay, that's what we needed. So, we could sleep here if we desired. And then, let's just double check our way back in. Yeah, so when we come out of the caves, we're going to want to make a left. And then zip up and over as fast as we can. Yeah. Alright, I think that seems reasonable. Uh, let's check our... Let's check our stuff. We have UV flashlight, Moloch, Tolves, and firecrackers. I think what we're going to go for is flares. Yeah, portable safe zone. That seems very beneficial. And then a couple of Molotovs. Maybe we can craft a couple more. Yeah, so let's go ahead and uh, do just that. Uh, we want Molotovs. You know what? We should make some uh, medkits too. We've used a fair few of them, so uh, that's probably not bad. And then, you know what? Uh, what else have we got? Hmm. Uh, resistance boosters. Oh, that's right. We're not going to have room in there. Let's go for actually a couple more lockpicks before we forget. I can do that twice. And then... Molotovs. Hey there. So what did we have? I think we had four. I think we should have at least, what, say ten? We can burn through them very quickly, so I don't think that that's a bad idea. Also, uses up all of our string incredibly fast, which is kind of annoying, but it is what it is. Let's go ahead and sweep until night time. Uh, yeah. Walk in our progress from the day. Alright, so, got our health restored, it's night time, we can uh, make our way up, and hopefully, actually, hang on a second, um, hmm, we don't have those see in the dark things, do we? No, we, uh, used that up. Hmm, yes, we had, uh, what do we call them? The, uh, Second available weapons. No, we wanted uh, utilities. Yeah, night vision boosters. Okay, we need aha uh -huh. fluorescent shrooms. Okay, well, we know that next time. That's fine. Let's get a reload on our gun before we get running, and uh, we're gonna see if uh, we can go for a quick swim and avoid too much trouble. Alright, so uh, yeah, make sure we swim up before we uh, need to take a big breath. Down we go. Good news is if we're being chased, we shouldn't have to worry about much. Now, the question is, are there, are there baddies in here? There do seem to be a couple. Um... I do not know. Hang on a second. Let's change. There we are. Um, you know what? 
Let's make sure we get a good whack. Cool. Alright. We got that sorted. Search out all there. Let's go. And see if we can lock pick. Oh. Uh, where were we? Alright, no one seems to be after us. We need 10 mushrooms, so... Take what we can get a hold of. There's definitely got to be at least, uh... Ooh, electronics? Fantastic. We can finish another quest with that. Um, so let's check. Nothing there. Now that is fairly secure. Oh, they're the mushrooms. Okay, so let's just go back and double check. Yeah, we have some of them too. Alright, now we know what we're looking for. Yeah, here's more. Definitely need some of them. Uh, let's see, what else can we find? I think we're fairly clear. Nothing in there. Yeah, lots of virus outside, but again, that's not our problem. They don't seem to like the water, so I'm not, not really too concerned. Now, let's climb up over here. And yeah, there we go. We'll, uh... we'll finish you off. Yeah, not too bad. Some extra cigarettes as well is always good. Or mushrooms. Yeah, I think this is definitely far more doable during the uh, night time than when we uh, popped through before. That was uh, kind of annoying. Alright, let's go for a run and a jump. Pick up those mushrooms. And then... Where else can we go? Got some more over there. Oh, can we make that jump? I think we probably can. Ow. That was, uh, not what we desired, but okay. Actually, can we find any plants in here underwater? Doesn't look like there's much of any. All right, well then, I guess we're just gonna go up and around again. We'll try and do that a second time, this time a little bit more successfully though. Make a successful jump, that'll be good. Right on that jump. There we are. That's what we're after. Uh, so that's nine, we need one more. Oh. Fantastic, so that's all that we needed. Uh, let's get out of here, because we have found all that we can. Alright, excellent. So, uh, with that sorted, let's go ahead and set our safe zone as our direction. We'll uh, go... Wait a second, which way was it out? No, that wasn't the right direction. We need to go in this direction. There we go. Uh, yeah, so where do we go? Up over there. There we are, okay. A little bit on the angle. There we are. Alright, that will do nicely. We don't have to worry about too much here. Uh, obviously, we're going to get chased as we pop up on the other side, but that is fine by me. I'm not really too concerned about that. We have a very short distance we need to travel. So, uh, I am all right with this. All right, up we go. Let's go for a bit of a run. We can already see the blue lights of the safety zone. That's exactly what we want. Let's climb our way up. And, uh, oh, there we go. Fantastic. Let's go ahead and, uh, sleep for the night.
That is plenty of survivor points having done all of that. Fantastic. So, now let's turn our flashlight off, of course. We can make our way to... Yeah, we can return to Delilah. Uh, she has... Uh, yeah, we're trying to make sure that we have this ability too, because she said if she could make us a thing where we're not going to be attacked, we might be able to benefit on other missions, like trying to uh, escape from the bridge with the UV light bulbs without uh, as much trouble. So either way, let's go. Survivor? Where is the survivor? Oh, hang on. We got you. There you go. I need your death, my friend. We'll take that weapon mod. That'll be fine. Let's go up and over. And let's see what she has to say. Hang on a second, where is she? Oh, there she is. Daisies. This tincture will give you some ability to be among the Immortui. It will not last long, and it may disturb your senses. Solutions of greater potency can be prepared, but they will require more powerful agents and greater risk. Now, you are ready to serve me. What do you want? From you? Why, nothing at all. I will never ask anything of you, runner. You may go about your business and do exactly as you think you should. A man of free will. But the truth is that you will always be doing my bidding. Even now, you are under my complete control. Uh-huh. You know, I kind of wonder with a uh, response like that. Oh, wait, so we have an inventory full issue. Um, even with all of that, I do kind of wonder whether if we just went ahead and said, uh, and did no more missions for her, whether that would be like an achievement. I feel like that would be something that they would do in a game like this. Uh, also too, you know what, let's just go ahead and we gotta break something down. I suppose, hmm. Chef's knife versus crowbar. I guess we're getting rid of the chef knife. Let's go ahead and, uh, destroy that for some metal that'll do and then let's take uh, I will the summon potion. you again when the time comes go now enjoy your illusion of freedom you may leave but we are not done you will be back okay so you know what uh that was a new that was a new blueprint so what was that? That was... Let's see if we can find it. Um, let's see, we did pick up the poison pen on another one. Uh, let's see, exorcist. That seems a little odd. Maybe if we scroll down. Yeah, utilities. Okay, shroom, poison. So we need alcohol, gauze, and fluorescent shrooms. Okay, well, you know what? We know where we can find some of those, and we probably should. Uh, having a few of those up our sleeve would not be bad. Uh, let's see, where was it? I think the fluorescent shrooms. Uh, around these buildings here. Yeah, not too far away. Actually, no, that's not right. Um... Yeah, I think it's around here we found some of the fluorescent ones. So let's aim to run up over there. Uh, we should find... Hang on a second. Uh, there is a thing to get inside that building. Okay. Um, oh no, we have some fluoro ones over there. Oh, that's what it is. Yep, sorry. That's the uh, buildings that I was thinking of. Yeah, we can probably go for that. Either that or we could make our way towards... There, but I don't think that there's anything yeah, fluorescent in that vicinity. So, yeah, let's just go ahead and uh, pick up a couple more. A couple more, and we'll see what we can do. Also, you know what? This guy seems to have another challenge for us, so let's ask him about it. Crane, until now, you were lucky. But today is the day of truth. 
truth, huh? So you're finally gonna admit you're slower than I am? <laughs> you have me in stitches. Still think you can beat me? Without even half trying. So do it. Okay, let's see. Is this any harder than what it was okay, previously? Okay, put up or shut up. Uh, this one is gonna be hard. Oh, four checkpoints without taking any damage. Oh. Um... You know what? We may as well see what it entails. Let's go ahead and accept. Uh, let's go ahead and get that done. Let's go ahead and shoot by those zombies. And then I guess we can go off to the side. A few of them may try and get a swing, but I don't think they'll be very effective. Yeah, those spirals we can leave behind. That'll be perfectly acceptable. Oh, let's, uh... Let's make... Oh, that guy's taking shots at us. That's kind of disgusting. Hopefully we'll be fine. Again, can't take damage, so we don't want to accidentally get too close to the flame. And then... What have we got? This last one here? Ah, yeah, that's easy. Well, awkward for him. The tower is not big enough for the two of us, Crane. Wow, 2,000 cash. Sweet. Well, we'll take it. I absolutely will take it. So, uh, let's go ahead and uh, check out those fluorescent shrooms. That is uh, going to be good for us. Let's climb up over here. Again, the safe zone's not really too concerning. Um. Oh, that's a good chunk of zombies. Let's uh, go ahead and... Where's our Molotovs? Yeah. Go ahead and burn a couple of them. Good. And then I guess we'll climb up over here as well. Can we get any... Can we gain any points? It's not too bad. Yeah. Actually, you know what? We're stacking up some... Uh... You know what, being able to stack up our uh, combat points after getting a kill is kind of nice. That makes that so much easier. Alright, you know what, slide a bit about, slide a bit of uh, fire damage, that's fine. Let's swing back over to a bow and arrow just in case we have any more volatiles trying to spit some of their uh, disgusting things around. Uh, let's go in. Jafar here. About the dynamite you brought. We've got an idea how to improve it. Drop by as soon as you can. Ooh. Okay. Cool. Well, you know, I'm uh, never opposed to uh, upgrading. Oh, the Big Bang pieces. <laughs> cool. Uh, let's see, what's going on here? Yeah, he's certainly in a bit of a predicament. That's a nice, easy save. Hey there, buddy. Jesus. I was never so afraid of my life. I've got a daughter and I... I can't even think what would happen to her if I got stuck here. Oh, there was that uh, disgusting viral spitting in our direction, but unfortunately we didn't see him until... There we go. That's better. No ammo back there. That is a bit of a pity. Hey, uh, you know what? Let's search. Hmm. Can we... Okay, it looks like we picked up some extra survival skills. I guess that's uh, survival points. Let's go... <laughs> Let's avoid them. 
Uh, we want to be finding the fluorescent mushrooms. Where are the little globy friends? Oh, there they are. Some of them there. Some of them there. Actually, you know, let's just uh, get the melee ready just in case. Oh, let's grab some of those. Them. Run across them. Hmm. Okay, just a few of them. All right, let's go sprinting other direction. Pick up some more. Make a gap. Move on by. Come on. There we go. Any more? Okay, there are a couple more. No, let's go. Whoa! Alright, good amount of karting. That's always a good plan. There we are. Bring it back in this direction. Oh. Another viral. Okay, hang on. I gotta climb up here. We want a little bit of separation just in case. Where is he, buddy? Yeah. Alright, so that's at least enough shrooms for us to uh, make what we need. Uh, we could do the hangar, but I think we're going to go ahead and make our way back to Jafar, and then we'll go ahead and drop off those binoculars. I think that's a uh, decent plan for things. Alright, uh, let's see. Anything? Ooh. Hey, no, that's fine. We'll uh, make our way around. Alright, rested for a couple of seconds. There we go. Make our way back up and over. Come on. There we go, that should be pretty good. Sometimes I forget that we have, uh, as much as we use that drop kick. Sometimes I forget just how versatile it can be for uh, clearing a path or uh, making, well, some zombies go in a direction that's better for us than them. Uh, Alright, that's fine. You know what? Let's just climb up and over. That'll do. Okay, fantastic. So, uh, we need to talk to Jafar. Where are you, bud? Hey there. Glad you made it. Go see Kurt. He'll explain everything. Yeah, well, of course, because uh, that makes sense. Uh, let's go ahead and make sure that we have this mission track, just so we're not... Yeah, here we go. Alright, so, where are you, buddy? Kurt. Crane, that dynamite of yours. I'm making it into an anti-personnel bomb. It'll mow down the infected like a harvester. I'm going to combine it with firecrackers and a load of shrapnel, but I'm missing a few things. Starting with a suitable casing. A battery from a truck would be perfect. There's this big truck on the overpass. Well, it's hanging over the edge of the overpass, but... You're an athletic type. Huh? You'll be fine. Alright, cool. Well, you know what? I think that's a pretty decent mission to pick up with on the next one. So if you do want to see that, be sure to hit that subscribe button. It is the best way to catch all future content, and I'll see you next time. So until then, thank you for tuning in to the Leviathan Cove. This is the Leviathan, signing out.